Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Njoki. If you're new here, Karibu Sana. And if you're returning, welcome back. I appreciate you. So now today we're gonna be doing we'll be tackling my kitchen. We're gonna reset it, we're gonna remove everything and clean everything. I'm really hoping that I'll be able to do as much as I want to do because I want to do some kitchen shopping and before I do that I need to make an inventory of what I have and what I want to get so I'll have to clean out everything everything is a mess in this kitchen <laughs> don't judge me too harshly um yeah so I want to restock and to get rid of some plastics I have way too many plastics and i want to arrange boxes for appliances and put them aside uh, appliances that don't work i need to figure out what i'm gonna do with them and just basically do a major declutter because i want to change things up and i can't be able to do that if i still have the things that are just filling up this space i feel like i have a small kitchen as opposed to the previous house um if you missed my empty house tour i'll link that video up above so that you can be able to see what i'm talking about if you remember my previous house i had way more storage space a, a lot more so this time around i have a bigger living room so my couch is looking nice but then the kitchen is so small so i need to really you know move things around get rid of stuff so that i can create space for more things <laughs> i don't know if i'm solving a problem or creating more problems but yeah i need to make this kitchen feel like my space make it have my touch so yeah enough rambling let's get right into the video this house is that thing the storage is very high so you have to panda a stool like right now um on top of a stool it's too high and then um yeah that's the situation this is the before that's the before everything is just everywhere i have some yeast that is dead over here and i'm not even using this jar can you imagine like yeah so i need to figure out something i need to clean out everything and just make an inventory of everything this is the other side we could do a lot of things <laughs> and tons of plastics yeah am i a hoarder <laughs> maybe i might just be a hoarder because why do i have all those things and my spices and teas everything is just everywhere and now that the this house doesn't come with drawers i've resorted to this but i need to change things up this blue band and yoga thing are just holding my things with their dear life and um i have whisks here like there are things that don't have places and then more hoarding on this side these are empty bottles um i need to get you i need to figure out this part because it has some dawas that I don't know. Siju cameras may expire. Upper we are so close to the light, so I don't know. I'll check them out. So that's basically it. Down here, no form of organization. To kona onions kwa wingi and the rest are just carrier bags. Quick overview of this kitchen. Now let's change things around and let's write what we need and then let's go shopping. I don't know if i'll take you guys along with me hopefully i can but either way i need to find out i need to really clean the spaces and you know give out whatever i no longer need so yeah it's 
so annoying that you're smart That your casual conversation Even a short duration Can cover everything from science space to art It's so obnoxious that you're kind That you always have time for family And help out everybody As if a million things don't occupy your mind If you could be just a little less perfect Then I could say I don't have time and it's not worth it and that one have fit only this uh, number of items and I really feel like it should probably fit more it should probably fit more um, because of the arrangement situation uh, these are not all the plastics that I have I have way more so we're gonna clean up those two before we can continue went to because the kitchen is so small i need to be cleaning as i replace them up and then because this is a closable it's a closable shelf it has the door it's gonna assist putting before i get to the top bit of the the top bit of the of the shelf i don't know i'm rambling a lot but that's the idea clean i'm gonna be using this product and a clo a microfiber cloth i also have this small roll I may need to go get some more um, to replace with the current newspaper situation. I decided to just clean all the dishes uh, that were in the cabinet above and I made the conscious decision because some of the 
some of them had like that on them, especially like the seasonal masks and the glasses that we've not used in a while because we are always using plastics in this house. So, uh, there to wash, uh, to wash, I used the dish soap, the Skaweda dish soap, I think it was lunchtime, and some bit of hot water because it was a really cold day. And here is a hack for the deeply stained mugs, especially the ceramics inside, the ones that are thrifted. I used scoring powder with a thin yaku washer, then you scrub inside. So, Kiangalia for scoring powder, uh, they put, it's used for floors and it can be used to shine the sink. It can also be used, it's food safe. So, it can be used um, in, the, in the cups. Especially, like you can see, some of my mugs were really stained from using because we always take black coffee or black cocoa. We rarely take milk, so the rims kind of get the, the brown uh, thing. So, to just brighten up your utensil, this is a hack. Just use some kidogo to scoring powder and then use a denimi, the thing for washing the dishes, and it's gonna be as good as new if you're enjoying this content so far please give it a like subscribe if you haven't comment down below um you know what let's cue the music you i haven't thought about you in a while i haven't thought about that beautiful smile and how it used to make my heart go wild To my eyes And all I could think was Why did I have to fall for you this time? dry nimezeka nimezeka these are the seasonal mugs stacked my wine glasses and glasses we don't use is in a peana this ones i'm retaining them i'm gonna get new plates this is the everyday use ones 
this plastic zilikuja na thermos so retaining that and sippy cup in a fuck pan and then everyday plates so there's more room but kuna vitu zimesijaeka bado so that's the overview okay and then we go to the next next being this one need to get rid of this newspaper hi guys it's the next day <laughs> and um in the kitchen i want to continue from where i left off uh i got some few groceries jenna so i want to prep them some daniels and some for host wash and then we can continue with the kitchen organization so let's do this now i don't know if i'm the only one who does this but after you bought kina ice cream or order takeout sometimes i just look at the container and i'm just like wait i might need this I might need this for this. I might need, <laughs> and before you know it, you have tons and tons of plastics that you're dealing with in your home. So stick around till you till the end where you'll see the 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 number of plastics that I have. So these daniels, I got them from someone's shamba um was selling and so now my your traffic of passing Whee! oh god okay Whoa! take two wow so I, I got this from someone's shama and i've washed them this is worth denia worth 20 bob and then um I shall wash the sink as well cuz so I'm going to cut and separate cut the roots separate the the stems because we use the we use the denier stems to cook and the leaves so I completely uh, separate them and cut them so yeah let's do this Every time we talk, I gotta walk away You never hit me on the matter what I say Have you ever heard of give and take? I'm so frustrated, but I won't cry, nah You are so stuck in your ways Don't know how much I can take Some say I gotta be patient Cause Rome was in the So this is the Dania leaves and these are the stems so i'm gonna put them in the freezer and i'm going to use them when i need
embarrassing me. You're embarrassing me. Think it's the wrong day. Think it's the wrong day. Think you better leave. Now I decided to make sure that I am cleaning all that needs to be cleaned. Some of these jars had the, you know, expired stuff, so I had to remove and then wash them before I now look for something else for for it to hold. Then I proceeded to use this kitchen liner, which really gave me a hard time. <laughs> Reason being because it's not. It doesn't hold. Una 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 roll una kata lafu. It rolls back up. So I had to put stuff on it so that it shake. Then I went on to the top part of the of the pantry. Can we call it a pantry? Or <laughs> I I don't consider this a pantry, but yes, I the top part, and I caught a huge surprise. Because I remember moving in, I was so busy unpacking other things. I told my previous nanny, uh, you know, just clean the the nini, the two the drawers, kila kitu with water and soap and uh, kitamba, and then you you line the <coughs> you line the newspaper, then so that you can be able to put stuff. Kumbe this chick didn't do anything. She just decided. Uh, I'm not cleaning this, so I was caught with a huge, huge surprise when I got up there, and it was so dirty, it was so filthy, it was so gross even cleaning it, but I had to do it because I, I first of all, I didn't know that that was the state uh, on top there when it was, I decided to do this clean. I just thought, hey, it's been a while since I cleaned here. Let me, you know, dust things off and ensure everything is clean. Kumbe. Like, I was, I was so shocked. I was so shocked, but I had to get it done because it was neglected and I had no idea. I had no idea um, coming up there and I was so shocked. I was so shocked and and now I've decided it's gonna be you know part of my routine I'm gonna be randomly like you know clearing everything out and cleaning it because it was not it was absolutely not making me happy the condition that I found up there so yeah I was really I was really mad that I needed I needed a I needed to, it to be very, very clean. You see the way you can double cleanse your face. Now with this area, I was not taking any chances. I decided I'm gonna use disinfectant two times, twice, twice. Much better than it was before. And Miraculously, the paint that was here in my talker when I was disinfecting with the astonish disinfectant. So, that's it. One side done. Okay. We are still organizing. Now, <laughs> to the next side. I was doing fine And then your path crossed mine It's not making any sense I'm under your influence And now I'm falling down, 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 down I just need one Conversation, boy, you Cause you've got a graphic 
sensational pull. Oh, and I feel it from deep within your soul. No matter what I do, can't stay away from you. Cause you've got a gravitational pull. Gravitational. Brand new solar systems forming Well, I felt your energy And I don't know how to break free Now that I'm falling down, 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 down I just need a wine Conversation, baby boy You owe me that, yeah, yeah, yeah Cause you've got a gravitational pull Oh, and I feel it from deep within your soul No matter what I do, can't stay away from you Cause you've got a gravitational pull Gravitational Feel the planets all align I can't give you up I'm giving in and I'll give it time And maybe we'll go on forever Infinitely I surrender Cause you've got a gravitational pull Oh, and I feel it from deep within your soul No matter what I do Can't stay away from The second shelving thing, Pakapo Jubado. I just wanted to show you. Uh, so, this is what my previous Nani to Kihamia Ali clean. This side, not so bad, but not thoroughly. No, Nali Kwama. No matter this side, how come I find it at all? So, eh, nannies will will show you the most. They will test your patience. They will say that they've done something. Na hawajamaliza ama hawajafanya. So this is me. Way too long <laughs> tackling it. See how bad it is. Na hapo katikati. So alifanya tu kufunikia after we have mad here. Because I was busy. I, I didn't have time to to confirm the work that she was doing. I was busy unpacking all my utensils. So that's what we are, want to talk. So this is the after. Looking fresh. Clean. Empty. On this side. I couldn't film because do you want to make the video too long? Kuna zenya zitoke. Um, but it's looking better than it was before. So what we're going to do is organize. See how many plastics I have. Ziko mingi. There are way too many plastics. And more things on here. And more things over there. So everything is just everywhere. I've even had to put the the rack over here. Because these are clean utensils. I didn't want Uchafu Fikir. So that's that. 
Can you imagine I had maple syrup and I was about to buy more because siku anajua kama iliisha. This used to be a set but then now um June is like za kuchukua kutoka home like we don't have the thing for for it to hang so zitaka hapa with the, the other red things and then the bread knives and then the mixer things and this mechanical whisk so that's how I've arranged that one and then I decided to add another plastic thing just to hold my forks I don't have many forks but here they are all of them and since they're not so many I didn't want this thing to be so flimsy so I've added the vichungis in there and then for the most I have spoons or oh, my spoons there so now let's put them in there where they're supposed to be rather so here are the muikos and miscellaneous here they have two categories is in a fox is in a spoons just to make things easier to get until i get proper storage so the things that are up are those that's the aftermath the organization supplies okay this side change things around kidogo and everyday cutlery so there's nothing at the top so far but when i get when i buy the eggs Zeta kokoju. Um that these are the the only containers that I've been keeping and they're gonna go somewhere up um for for the time when I buy um uh, cereals in bulk. So I'll just put them there until I get proper storage. It's much later in the day. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for watching this video up till the end. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Uh, like, comment down below anything <laughs> that you loved about the video. Or if you enjoyed this content, let me know down in the comments section. Do subscribe, share with your friends. And until the next one, I'll see you. Bye. And maybe we'll go on forever Infinitely I surrender Cause you've got a gravitational pull Oh, and I feel it from deep within your soul No matter what